Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, ladies and gents. This is the Silver Stacking Dad back at you today. We're going over a little bit of new information that has been brought to light today, uh, which is the death of the dollar and the rise of cryptocurrency. So I'm just going to go over a little bit of information. Some of this may be a little older, some within the last 48 hours has been shed a little, a little light. So let me just start here. The first is the great divide in crypto, central bank digital currencies versus normal digital currencies. So we see here that there is a competition between the central banks uh, you know, JP Morgan, uh, etc., uh, versus standard digital currencies like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Litecoin, uh, Dogecoin, etc., where they don't want you to stick your money in those unregulated, uh, you know, cryptos. So they're going to start rolling out their own here for you. Uh, you know, but let's go back to the dollar here. And so as the dollar hovers near the four month lows, uh, so, you know, it shows here that the dollar languished near four month lows against major currencies on Monday as bets on a robust global economic recovery continue to support currencies seen as riskier. Uh, you know, so it just shows that uh, the dollar is losing its uh, global presence. Uh, and other countries are looking for alternatives. So let's go to those other countries here, or even let's listen. Uh, you know, Federal Reserve is likely to create a digital currency, says Goldman Sachs. Uh, Goldman Sachs chief economist Han thinks that it will be some time before the Federal Reserve creates a digital currency to compete with the dollar, but it's likely to happen. The Fed, I think partially because of the pre-international role of the dollar is going to slower than other central banks in introducing a digital currency. And there is quite a number of central banks globally that are hedge at this point. And the Fed is still in the research stage. But ultimately, I think there is an appetite for introducing a digital currency. Uh, you know, so they are trying to roll this out, uh, but they're saying that it is uh, in its introducing stage, uh, you know, that it's not, uh, or actually a research stage, uh, but I think it's a little bit farther along. I think they've been talking about this some time now behind closed doors and have uh, kind of already got it in set in stone on how they're going to roll it out a little bit at a time. You know, we are being spoon fed. A little bit instead of being force-fed in big gulps uh, so they're just taking it easy uh, but we go here to China you know China creates its own this is a little bit older news here but China creates its own digital currency a first for a major economy uh, so a thousand years ago when money meant coins China invented paper currency now the Chinese government is minting cash digitally and a reimagination of money that could shake a pillar of American power uh, so they are definitely trying to, uh, you know, regulate uh, crypto such as Bitcoin uh, because it's a contender against their digital yuan uh, for international use, de designing it to be untethered to the global financial system. Uh, so of course they're trying to reign supreme uh, and get away from that dollar. Uh, and then we come here, you know, and shows that local digital currency law needed for Turkey's IT growth. Turkey developing its own digital token with national capabilities is critical for the development of country's digital economy. So you see, you know, Turkey here, you see South Korea, uh, central bank moves to develop pilot for digital currency. Uh, so again, South Korea's central bank on Monday said it will choose a technology supplier to build a pilot platform for a digital currency, moving a step closer to creating a central bank-backed digital currency. Brazil announces digital currency guidelines. The plans to launch a digital real are part of the central bank's modernization agenda for the country's payments industry. The announcement of 
on the intentions to create a central bank digital currency, a CBDC, made today as part of the central bank's agenda uh, for the modernization of the Brazilian payment industry, guys. You see this here. This is Brazil, South Korea, Turkey, China, you know, the U.S. dollar. This is the death of the, the fiat currency of uh, paper, paper currency, guys. This, this is in real time here. This is them pushing and moving closer and closer to that. Uh, so I just go here and I look. To date, current countries that have issued their own cryptocurrencies include Ecuador, China, Senegal, Singapore, Tunisia, though these countries will not be standing alone for long. Estonia, Japan, Palestine, Russia, and Sweden looking to launch their own national cryptocurrencies. Uh, so again, you know, it's it's in the in the works here, guys. This isn't something that is uh, two, three, four years down the road. This is happening in real time as we speak. So if you're holding on to those paper dollars, one day soon, they're just going to not be worth much. Uh, you know, they're going to have you turn them in, transition them, melt down all the coins, uh, burn all the paper. Uh, there's no need for it once all this starts to roll out and individual current currencies of countries are dealing in digital. Uh, and I can see that, again, you know, the cryptocurrency, you know, normal, uh, unregulated, uh, decentralized currency uh, is going to be a big contender against the central banks. Uh, and the governments aren't going to let that happen because the the governments are run by the central banks, uh, and they're not going to let these other cur you know cryptos here be a contender. They're going to create their own, and then they're all going to uh, agree on a singular currency for international exchange. What that currency is going to be, I have no clue, uh, but that certainly more than likely won't be any of the top contenders right now uh you know it could be you know don't get me wrong could be bitcoin could be ethereum you know my my guess would be ethereum uh just because of its platform and all the multi uses of it uh but again who am i to to know anything i'm a silver stacker so uh but again i'm going to get off here i'm going to leave some links below i would love your guys's opinion uh, in comments, if you could like, subscribe, share, you know the routine, guys. I need some support here. I need more viewers. So let's get this word out that the death of the dollar is here and the rise of crypto is here. Thanks again.